super childish P. Good night. Hello everyone. Witamy w kolejnej bajce na dobranoc. Dzisiaj przeczytam bajkę, którą doskonale wszyscy znają pod tytułem Jaś i Małgosia. Hansel and Gretel. Czarny już sobie śpi, więc będę czytała cichuteńko, specjalnie dla Was. Far, far away, in the little house in the forest lived a brother and a sister, Hansel and Gretel. There was hunger and poverty in the neighborhood. In spite of that, the children were happy and helped their parents with joy. They often went with their father, who was a woodcutter, to the forest and they would come back with a basket full of berries or mushrooms. One day they lost their way while walking back home. Darkness fell and a strong wind started blowing. You could hear the wolves howling in the distance. The children hugged each other and waited for the morning to come. In the morning, the children saw a little house on the fringe of a glade. When they come closer, they saw that it was built from honey cake. <gasps> Being hungry, they could not stop looking at the walls covered with raspberry icing, shining savory tiles made of fruit drops and ice creams with whipped cream standing in the garden. Oh, very delicious! At last they could not bear it and broke off a little bit of cake. Suddenly the door opened with a cracking noise and an old lady appeared on the doorstep. Smiling kindly she asked the children to come inside. No sooner they had come inside when they realized that in reality she was an ugly old witch. At last I've got a tasty bit of to eat. She called laughing and what she wanted to eat the children immediately. But after a moment of thinking she said, huh, little boy, you are too thin and I'll have to fatten you up a little. And she locked Hansel in a dark closet. The girl was asked to clean the little house and cook food for her brother. From day to day Hansel was becoming fatter. To check if the boy was ready to be eaten, an old lady asked him every evening to show her a thumb. <laughs> but the clever boy, knowing that the witch did not see very well, showed a little bitten of bone instead of his finger. <laughs> Three months had passed by. At last the old lady lost her patience heated the oven and took the boy from the closet. She put Hansel on a big shovel and tried to put him in the oven. In vain, the boy was too fat to be put in the oven. The witch decided to show him what he should do. When she laid herself down on the shovel, Gretchen pushed her directly into the hot oven. Let's run! shouted the girl, taking her frightened brother by the hand. The children ran from the honey cake house and as fast as they could, they ran to the forest. Friendly animals helped them to find a way home where the longing parents were waiting. There was no once again happiness in the small house and nobody ever heard anything more about the ugly witch. Wspaniała po prostu opowieść o bracie i o siostrze. Super historia. Mam nadzieję, że Wam się podobała. Jeżeli tak, to subskrybujcie, polubcie i oczywiście słodkich snów Wam życzę. Do zobaczenia w kolejnym odcinku. Bye, bye!